All right, this is Mill Spec Monkey, and we're here with... This is Tyler here at Black Rain Ordnance at TriggerCon 2023. And today we're kind of highlighting our uh, our 22 that debuted this year. So here we've got uh, four or five of the different models we have. And uh, we kind of took, uh, took the semi-auto 22 and redesigned it and just made it, made, it, made it more functional and run a little better. So we've got a three and a half pound uh, force reset billet trigger we put in it. We put dual internal skis in the rail system here and uh, made it run more efficient, made it run a lot better accuracy wise. Here we've teamed up with Magpul, Boyd Stocks, Luth AR, Hogue, and uh, just a few to, to highlight. And over here, we'll roll into uh, our table here. We've got some of our, our standard models. We've got a laser camo here. We also make a 350 Legend, a 6.5 SPC, um, even make a 6.5 Grendel here as well. So we kind of make anything that it, you can dream of and uh, just try to keep it pretty standard. Other than that, we also do laser mags. We have our own mags in-house. Uh, we do laser designs on anything. So any design you want, we can put your company logo or a custom design and we laser it on all of our mags as well. Brett, are these your proprietary mag design? It is, yep. So we uh, we teamed up with the men too and we kind of did a little design with them, put our own, uh, our own name on it, our own little flair, and then we put whatever logos or laser designs you want on them. All right, how about tell us more about those rifles? Yeah, so here we got the 350 Legend on our AR platform here. Um, it's on our 15 inch rail here, and this is a FDE color. Um, you've got your M-Lock slots on the top and the bottom so you can attach your accessories. Um, we're running your standard AR-15 bolt on it. And it's a round comp, so we've got that 350 Legend running, and it's good to go for those straight wall cartridges, straight wall states that need those for hunting. Looks like get pretty good air on those that rail style. Yeah, absolutely, you got good airflow. You're able to, uh, you have enough system to where if you have an adjustable gas block, you can get in between it, still adjust your gas block um, into that nature. It keeps your hands pretty cool, enough airflow where you're not heating up and getting hands hot. Right on, and any particular reason why only do so much M lock on the sides there? Uh, we just do a little on the, on the sides, just enough, but we have a plenty of attachments on the bottom. Um, just enough on the top, maybe run your light or a laser type uh, situation there. But the M locks on the bottom seem to be working out pretty well, um, as well as the M locks on the side for those three. Was it for structural integrity or? Yeah, yeah, structural integrity. We OEM a lot of parts. Um, so we have our name on the rail. So, like, if someone's just wanting our rail, they know that they can put that rail on any other gun and they know it's a black rain rail if it performs well. Or, it's, you know, same with our upper. We kind of keep our logos on them. So, we OEM a lot of outsource parts to, to sell to people that way. Right on. Right. Well, thanks for the extra details. And Absolutely. Thanks everybody else for watching. Absolutely, thank you. Uh, by the way, these are our flag guns here. They look custom, but believe it or not, our paint guys are good enough that they keep these as a production level gun. They figured out how to make the paint schemes production level and production friendly to where they're not just custom one-offs. So you can get any of these. We have the Betsy Ross, your FD OD flag. We even have the Gatson snake here that's deep engraved on the Gatson rail and the upper and lower. We have the obsidian flag, and then our, our most common, most popular seller is the uh, Patriot American flag rail, and uh, that whole setup here. If you like this video and want to support us, check out the Millspec Monkey Store. Although known for morale patches, we also specialize in a good selection of DIY hardware and tactical accessories.